All right, so I unlocked all the gun pods finally on Iron Hander. So let's check them out. Let's get to this crap. So, of course, there's originally three uh, ships you can choose from. This is the one with the standard one, one machine gun, but it has three gun pods, so you can have, like, technically uh, four different weapons. This is the easiest one to use. It only can equip one gun pod, but it always has two machine guns that never run out, so it's uh, pretty good for most situations. And this is the most complicated one. Um, you actually have two gun pods at the same time. So you can make a ton of combinations because there's 12 different gun pods. So yeah, do the math on that one. And then of course, it's just got one machine gun. Um, I personally just like going with this, the, uh, the easy to use one. And now let's check out all the different um, gun pods that I've unlocked. So this is the most rarest one actually, right? It started on default, that's cool. On Mosquito, it actually says, fires laser guided missiles for pinpoint accuracy. Missiles can be controlled by the movement of the fighter. So this one's probably the most, it's definitely the rarest. There's only one part of one level that you can actually unlock this one. But as you move your ship around, the missile follows the same movements and mimics them so you could destroy a lot of cool people. Um, very limited ammo though. Python is probably the mm, second rarest one. Uh, it actually shoots out these like explosive charge things that are stringed together. And you can move your ship around and it'll like twist the string. Um, and then it's kind of like a defensive weapon because it kind of just destroys the area uh, that you uh, chain it up around. That's what it starts off when you have nothing that's just the, the arm that holds the gun pod. the Vulcan's the standard weapon it's just uh, like a machine gun or a gatling gun it's what's the first one you encounter the cannon is probably the best of the uh, the eight gun pods that you can actually just find anywhere pretty much throughout the game because of the high damage the wasp is pretty cool um, it's a rocket launcher you can put it, of course, either on top or bottom of your ship. And this is one, if you put it on the top, it's a heat seeker. Um, and they're not quite as powerful when they're heat seekers, but they can hit stuff in the background. It's really neat. The spreader is a shotgun. It's, eh, it's me. Grenade's really powerful. A um, little bit more powerful than the cannon, but harder to hit people with. And uh, similar ammo situation, like low ammo all the time. Hedgehog sucks. It's it you either put it up or down and it just shoots straight up or straight down. It's pretty worthless. Uh, except for like on some bosses. Juno is my favorite. Um, it is basically the Vulcan, the the, um, the Gatling gun or the machine gun, but way faster and stronger. Uh, but man, this thing goes through like 400 bullets in about 10 seconds. So you're just, you don't want to waste it on little guys, you know? But it's definitely my favorite. It's uh, one of the four secret ones. But there's a couple places you can unlock it. Blade is literally a lightsaber. Um, it's one of the rare ones that uh, of the eight basic gun pods you can get. It's kind of cool. Um, you know, obviously there's an issue with the range of it. Uh, but, sorry. But uh, it's all right. Riot Gun, it's one of the strongest ones of the original. Like, you can actually get this on the first level. And you can charge this one up, which is neat. And um, it's uh, it's pretty good. It's pretty good, especially when you charge it up. It'll wipe out most stuff in a hit that's not a boss. Flash is my second favorite. It is a rail cannon. It shoots basically like it's a, like a laser blaster. And I think it might be the strongest, uh, maybe, yeah, maybe the strongest in the game. You start off with 45 ammo, uh, which is pretty cool. You can take out like any boss with that much really fast, like seven or se seven seconds or less than those. So that one's good. And then, yeah, so there is, should be 12 total. One, two, three, four. Wait, that doesn't count. Hold up, what is One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 
Yep, there's 12. The secret ones are the Python, which is pretty cool. Mosquito, which is cool. Flash is not a secret one. Uh, Juno is my favorite, it's a secret one. And, wait, and did I not say Python? Python, Mosquito, Flash, and Juno. All right, let's just see some footage of this. I'm playing just one-handed, so yeah, good luck with this. So this is your regular machine gun, the yellow firing bullets, and I can switch my Juno either the top or the bottom. On the bottom, you see how fast it fires. You can see the number just going down so quickly. I can't control anything because I'm holding the camera, but uh, it just completely, let me scoot up some, make this easier. There we go, because then I can fire down. But yeah, it just uh, like decimates people so quickly. Please don't accidentally get that, thank you. Pretty cool. Everything's in German in this game, all the audio and stuff, so it's just kind of neat. Uh, there's a spot coming up that'll probably kind of show the coolest part of that right here. Pretty neat. Um, cool techno soundtrack, I enjoy it. It's like Blade Runner in this uh, level a whole bunch. But anyway. Yeah, that's freaking Einhander. It's pretty awesome. Like I said, you can move the cannon or the um, manipulator either on top or bottom, which does different things. Pretty neat. Definitely a hard to find game. <clears throat>